Yo, what's going on? Today I'm showcasing some Nahida Burning with Ganyu Melt, and I'd say that I'm, I'm liking it so far. Uh, there are obviously caveats, there's some things to keep in mind when you're playing with it, but uh, here to kind of showcase some of them. Uh, you know, first thing is going to be you want to make sure that uh, you you're gonna manage you have to manage your the pyro appropriately. Of course, if you have other things acting on the pyro like Ganyu Alt or Zhongli Pillar, you can definitely start messing around with your burning. But it's pretty quick and simple to kind of reapply um, the the pyro if and uh, Nihita's skill if you need to if you mess up and things like that. And for the most part, it's a lot much it's a lot easier than the usual gameplay that you would have with Ganyu Melt like you know, using Zhengling for constant uh, pyro. Uh, I will showcase uh, Kazua in this kind of in this kind of comps and you kind of kind of see like uh, Kazua's damage. And of course, if you have C2 Kazua, right now the, in the showcase I'm using C0, of course that's going to be pretty big, but the thing is you're eating up a lot of your most strongest characters in these kind of teams. So uh, if, you're, if you're someone who cares about Abyss, uh, you're not, you're, the worst part about it is like you can see damage wise, Right, Ganyu, okay, yes, she does more with, with Kazuha, but especially, but and especially if you had C two, but you could use your C two Kazuha or C zero Kazuha somewhere else. Uh, so that, that's one of the, the best benefits of it, and you don't the damage drop off isn't crazy. Here's a, a bit of an example of just like uh, if you wanted to think like, all right, could I use other pyro applicators? And um, there are some that can still apply as much pyro as Bennett can, but I say Bennett is definitely the easiest as doing at doing it and uh, the most consistent. You can kind of see that Amber's charge shot doesn't apply enough, that you can definitely outpace it. Uh, but again, it's easy to reapply it, but it's a little more jank than just having the simple Bennett comp. Um, so now I want to showcase this with uh, Diona, right? So we're just going to show just Diona shielding uh, if you wanted to replace uh, Zhongli. And uh, yeah, you can see it's not that strong. And a little bit of showing you how it is if, ju if you just have Nahida. And with just Nahida's ult and skill with burning going on, it's still pretty good. So, I mean, you would always want to have them together. But it's still nearly doubling her damage just because, you know, you get that EM and you get that pyro. Um, here's a bit of the caveats, right? You get to see that uh, you, uh, I'm fighting this boss and Zhongli's pillar gets in the way of the pyro application. So it's one thing to manage uh, as well. Make sure that you aren't acting too much on the, you know, the burning. So you definitely want to make sure that you are only melting with Ganyu and not crystallizing or having Ganyu's alt active or that her skill is kind of far away from the, from the boss or the enemies you're fighting just so that you don't mess up. Uh, but yeah, uh, talk about messing up, uh, that's also why Zhongli is necessary, even if far away. So, the one thing I would say is that I, I like it. I like, uh, Ganyu Melt with, with, uh, Nihida. It allows me to use my Kazuha somewhere else, and, uh, it feels a lot more comfy than, you know, using Zhengling. So, I would say it's funner. It's definitely funner. You can see for yourself how it feels and stuff like that. Uh, getting, uh, Nihida's burst up for that, that's easy 200 EM, you know, assuming you have the two EM pieces on her. Is, is not bad at all. It feels good. Um, you you know, you could throw, you know, if you have enough EM, maybe throw some Favonius on there or whatever. Do what you, what you have to, but it's a 50 cost burst, so it's nowhere near as painful as uh, uh, Zhengling's 80 cost. So you can see this is the base stats with Ganyu. So I had 120 base, and then, you know, I'm giving like a, a whole boatload from Nahida's ult. Um, Ganyu's easily one of my strongest characters, so I was pretty excited to kind of see that they're, you know, Nahida and her have some synergy together. Uh, because I definitely only play uh, Ganyu for Melt these days. I really don't like playing her in Freeze, because Freeze plus Charge Shot is like I'm sleeping. But, yeah. And Deepwood, uh, if you want more EM, definitely go, um, you know, Gilded. Uh, you, you'll you'll uh, be able to definitely max out. I'm already basically maxing out, but if you really want to max out, you can go that way. But thanks for watching.